The taking property off the tax roll issue has come up a couple times here, and I just want to address that. I, I'm actually curious to know how often that's actually happened via the CPA. Um, a lot of these, a lot of the CPA money is going to improvements and not to purchasing properties. Uh, I know of a couple areas that I'm particularly I'm most familiar with land conservation. And when you're talking about something like land conservation, there's a number of different ways to conserve a piece of property, and it doesn't always take it off the tax rolls, especially if you put a conservation restriction on it, as opposed to buying it outright in fee. So I think it's a little more complicated than people are certainly saying. Um, also, there's another side to it too. Reports have come out, a number of reports have come out, looking at what happens to land that is conserved and how it affects the tax roll of the town. And it turns out the most expensive thing that you can do for a piece of land for a town is to build a bunch of houses on it. And it's tough to say because when you build houses, you have families and you have kids. And what is the biggest expense to a city but the school system? And report after report have shown that it's actually not, it doesn't really take that much money away from the town to protect land. It actually is much more expensive if you let that land be built.